Yeah. And one of the things that you're seeing these days, and I wanted to bring this up with you now that you're here. Jamie, pull up my, my Twitter profile. There was a tweet that I posted last night that I found this guy got in trouble for a fucking joke. And he wound up leaving this, uh, this company that uh, I think he's, he's involved in video games. He's been on Dave Rubin's show, and Dave Rubin was uh, raving about him. Look at this. Look what this guy wrote. <laughs> Let's cl click on the one on the left right there. This is what he wrote. Ah, peace and quiet, hashtag a day without a woman. Just a fucking joke. Just Real grouping, simple yeah. joke. Now, go to the next one, Jamie. Look what the fucking International Business Times wrote. Kind of funny, Colin Moriarty resigns after targeting women in racist joke. Insists it's his personal decision to resign. Racist? Did you, race? Is did there you, a race known as women? Are women a fucking race now? Did you know that, that a dad joke about women is racist? Get some brain surgeons over there at Ivy Times. Got, wow, that's crazy. Get some vac, uh, vacancies for real journalists, too. C click on that, uh, that, that quote again. Look at this. International Business Times. Fuck you. Why did he resign? Whoever this guy is, what is this guy by Mike, Mike Lukes? Lukes's? Lukes's, whatever your Lukes. name is. Fuck you, man. That is what you are doing right. That is virtue signaling at its very worst. You know that's not a racist joke. That is that what you did is you you targeted that guy. You went after that guy and you, you did it in a very deceptive way. That is it is if anything, it's it's just a joke. And you might not like it. You might think, well, that's not really good if you're working sure. in an environment with women. You know, like, you don't want to hear them talk. Like, that might be sexist. It's a fucking joke. And saying that it's racist, is it, that is so fucking deceptive. And manipulative. At least the guy fought back, though. Colin Moriarty, I don't know why he resigned. Maybe they were going to fire him. But like, what's this guy's article say? Well, how does he tie in race with it? It's got to be, he has to have some I don't know, connection. Let's go to the, uh, let's go to the article. It's, there's no, there's no fucking connection. It is, it's completely it crazy. Be. How could there be a connection? Unless, I don't know. Unless that's a race. Unless women are a fucking race. It's wow. just crazy that someone would think that it's okay to do that. I like that this guy's punching back though. I, I kind of like that he's not just taking it quietly and apologizing. Well, he quit whatever organization that is. Um, that he was working for, kind of funny, and just decided. And some of the people that he was working with shit on him for that joke. It's just a goddamn joke. Well, why is everybody so sensitive today? And is it that they're so sensitive, or is it that they're super ready to jump down other people's throats because they sense that this is a very hostile environment? And when you tell jokes, people are what? What are you doing? Is this it? He updated. Okay. When you? Sorry. Oh, he updated it. Yeah. And by the way, people, oh. I don't think it's that people oh, are- Oh, he took down the word racist. Okay, as racist. Still it fuck was you. Described as a joke tweeted by Colin Moore as racist. It was not. The article has been changed to reflect this. Still fuck you. Yeah, still fuck you is right. Still fuck you. That's Just right. Just fuck you, man. That, that This is- we got a real problem today in that people are jumping down people's throats for jokes, and they're they're doing it because they sense that they're soft targets, that it's, there's going to be a pile-on, and they sense the pile-on, they go, oh, this guy made a joke about women. Let's get him. A bunch of people are going to be getting him. This is a free shot. It's yeah. kicking someone while they're down. That's right. That's what it is. It's a drunk girl at the party, and you're sticking it right in her ass. People it's are basically the same thing. They're mean. No, it's not it, the same thing. It's, is that at all? No, but, but, no but it's, this, <laughs> it's the same shitty <clears throat> mentality behind it. It's that people, like, uh, people, they don't feel offended. They just feel it's a chance to be mean, and you can be mean to someone who who does something fucked up or says something racist or whatever so yeah people are just cunts that joke is every episode of married with children it is it's every episode uh, peace and quiet yeah yeah a day without a woman shut uh, up ding peace bad. and quiet yeah it's it. peace and quiet. family it's, come on uh, every episode of of um, honeymooners it's the same thing that was the word to the moon alice I know. he was threatening beating her i know with his fist <laughs> <laughs> like to the moon, alice. <laughs> yeah punching her <laughs> People just don't give a shit. There are so many weak, weak, weak men out there that go after people for jokes like that guy who made that guy, Colin Moriarty, is that his name? That made that joke. I'm having him on the podcast. I reached out to him last night after this. I was like, this is so crazy. So, and I looked at all his tweets and all the people that were piling on. I'm like, what in the fuck are you guys talking about? Yeah, this is so mild. It's so silly. Yeah. Who cares? Ah, peace and quiet. Jesus Christ, that's it? Yeah. That's it? That's all it takes? That's all it takes. For you to be disappointed with him? I mean, there's so many people, people that he worked with piled on. What was kind of funny? What was that, what was that magazine? I don't know. I don't even know what it was. Jesus. <clears throat> I never heard about it until last night. Somebody tweeted to me. 
um, that thing. And then he tweeted that at me that, did you know that it was racist to, you know, to make a joke about women? I was like, what is this? And then I looked into it. And I was like, oh, my God, this is so crazy. What a dick that guy was to put that. Though. I wonder if he thought it was racist or he There's heard no it way. was. Or How he could just, he possibly? I don't know. It's so simple. It's such a simple joke. I mean, there's no room for error there. A day without a woman, hashtag a day without a woman, and then, ah, peace and quiet. That's it? Yeah. You see racists there? It's crazy. Monsters. It's fucking <clears throat> crazy. Anti-human monsters. They want people to feel pain for almost no reason whatsoever, or they will go out of their way and use any tactic they can. If they, if they see that it's, if in, in their eyes, it's legit and it's, it's somehow or another warranted. And it's just that goddamn virtue signaling. There's so many weak men out there that virtue signal. They like to attack other men for anything that shows that they're better than that man. 